What's up, what's up, YouTube? Welcome back. Don with the Don Front Show. Uh, today with Tesla Tuesday, we're actually going to... So Tesla is kind of in the news in the spotlight right now. Uh, with the uh, the car. There was a Model S speeding. Uh, speeding hit a tree. Uh, the passengers did not make it. Uh, and it also, it caught fire. So the reason I say it's in the spotlight right now is because of... Um, they said it was a full self-driving that did it, and then Elon said no, because to be in full self-driving, there needs to be lines, visible lines on the road. It can't uh, go above the speed limit, and someone needs to be in the driver's seat. Uh, at the time of the wreck, someone was in the passenger seat, someone was in the back of the seat. Um, so that's what we see. We see the sell-off. We saw Elon come out and say that. No, that's wrong. Uh, it jumps up. A lot of people came forward online and said, uh, well, or just showing off videos online of people of no one in the driver's seat, cars speeding, cars on full self-driving that are not in the, uh, that don't have the, the visible lanes. Um, so kind of creating that argument. So it's under an investigation right now. Um, so that being said, as far as the stock goes, we're probably going to see a few headlines coming out. That's probably going to cause some intraday spikes. Um, so me personally, when I'm doing anything below this zone, I'm probably adding on pretty aggressively watching it here we do have earnings coming up earnings usually isn't the, isn't the exciting part we talked about this uh last time when deliveries come out that's basically the earnings move uh that's when we'll see most of the move and then um when earnings is announced that they'll have their their conference call talk about forward guidance and the past few times i think it's sold off even if they even if they hit um uh, but there was honestly that one tweet where Elon said we'll, we'll be the biggest company. It was kind of vague in a few months. So I'm kind of curious to see if anything like that gets uh, gets brought up. So I don't expect much on earnings, but I'm watching for a surprise, if that makes sense. Uh, definitely bullish above this one. Uh, I, I'm not going to be bearish. I'd be bearish if it broke below this this 570 zone. Uh, but anything below here, I think we might dip and make a higher low. So I'll be looking to just accumulate some, some more shares. But speaking of earnings, Netflix did have theirs. Now, if you round up, my average is about 490. Uh, if you were in the Own the Chaos live stream, I, I, you know, I told everybody when I was buying it in there. So my my average is 49.73. It dropped down in a minute. Just came all the way down here. Uh, I bought it the Type One. Almost got a little. It's like it didn't hang out here long, but it went lower. I was like, great. I could have got lower. Snapped right back up. So tomorrow, what I told the mentorship group tomorrow is. If we push up to here, there, this this green wick is just an easy way to remember it. I'm gonna put my stop at 509.85, um, and if it goes above, I'm gonna let it. I'm gonna keep my stop here for a little bit, let it dance around, and hopefully I can get a uh, take advantage of a bigger move up. But that being said, I'm in a bullish play. It is up. This is also very well just a dead cat bounce, an oversold bounce. You know, let's see where the continuation is tomorrow. This might just gap right back down, and I don't have anything tomorrow. You know, at that point, I'll be in recovery mode. I don't want it below this zone. So, uh, last but not least, everybody's favorite. It was Doge Day, uh, which was just like everything else. Buy the rumor, sell the news. It sold off. So, kind of back in here again. Uh, I actually did make a TikTok video about this. Uh, I think uh, I said something about you had to be high if you thought this was actually going to go up today. Uh, so it's under review, so that's why no one saw that. <laughs> My first video that literally is being censored right now because I said that. Um, that being said, as far as if you actually are trading Doge, I'm not here to roast you or anything like that. The one announcement I would be looking out for is um, is Coinbase going to allow this on their platform? Coinbase is one of the largest um, you know currency exchanges, cryptocurrency exchanges. Uh, you know, so as far as it being legitimized would be if Coinbase has it on there. So I think that that'll be also be a whole new surge of buyers coming in. Cause right now you can buy on Robinhood. Robinhood's good for nothing. You can't use that currency. Literally nothing. Uh, you know, like where I'm, if buying and selling stuff on Facebook, you guys can send me Ethereum. If you guys want to buy my course, um, just let me. You have to message me. But if you send me that, yeah, I'll give you my course, uh, the the teachable course. You can send me Bitcoin, Ethereum, whatever coin you want. Uh, so, you know, like I said, if Coinbase were to announce that, uh, there's going to be a lot of money that could be used. There could be a useful case for it now. Might have some more buyers in there as well. So, uh, that's the one announcement I'd be looking for. Other than that, nothing's changed. Bullish above here, bearish below here. We got the quick little fake out. So, right now, let's at least... This is a tough mark to get up to. So, all your sellers have shown up right there. 
nothing above that. So we'll keep an eye there. And I will keep this to the point. I will see you guys. Today's Tuesday. Yep. I'll see you guys tomorrow. I'll make sure you hit that subscribe button and that bell. I'll see you guys live tomorrow. We'll break down the week. And uh, right now, as far as the markets go, we kind of hit that two spot, that two, that second standard deviation. If you don't know what I'm talking about, watch Sunday's live stream where I talked about we're probably going to do this this week because we priced in a pretty uh, quiet week, which oftentimes, if it is not that quiet week, ends up being the exact opposite. And that's kind of where we're at. So tomorrow we're going to break it down. Let's see if we rein it back in or if we go even further to the downside. So I will see you guys there.